Mike program has been successful even through the winter. WLWT News Site's Christy Davis is leading the way for us tonight on the latest expansion. Well, this is part of a smaller expansion for Red Bike that'll be happening over the next couple of days. We're here at Fourth and Vine, but we wanted to know how the bike sharing program fared during those cold winter months. To hear Jason Barron talk about it, Red Bike is red hot. So far, people have been really excited about it. You know, Red Bike's been really popular. People are using it. It's a nice new thing in downtown. He's the executive director, so we expect him to be excited. But the bike sharing program launched in September with winter on the horizon. So, did the budding program weather the cold? Well, according to the numbers, other than the harshest parts of February, Red Bike more than survived the winter. We had some really great ridership numbers. We had 2,000 rides in December, 1,800 in January. You know, last couple of weeks have been a little snowy, but people were still out riding, even on the worst days. If you've got eight, ten blocks to walk, you're going to be just as cold, but when you're on the bike, you get it over quicker. It worked so well for bike enthusiast Frank Henson, he now leaves his own bike at home when commuting from Madisonville. Now I just get on the bus, come downtown, get off at a red bike station, get a red bike, and go. Red bike had 19,000 riders in the first six months. On top of four new locations today, Red Bike will also expand to Newport, Covington, and Bellevue this summer. Henson thinks people will find the program is as easy as riding a bike. It's pretty intuitive. You know, you get on a bike, you ride it where you need to go, you check the bike back in. So there you have it. Now, along with this expansion of four locations and the expansion across the river in northern Kentucky, Red Bike hopes to have more spots pop up all over Cincinnati this summer in time for the All Star Game. Reporting from downtown, Christy Davis, WLWT News 5. Yeah, in fact, Red Bike will be putting in four new docking stations in downtown Cincinnati over the next two days.